Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how you can create one of these uh, perforated walls or just walls that are have all these custom um, openings in them in ArchiCAD. Let's get started. So, so what you're going to do is select your wall tool. Once you do that, you're going to change the structure type of the wall. It can either be basic, composite or complex profile. You're going to choose complex profile option. <coughs> Once you do that, you're going to go to options, element attributes, profile manager. Once you're here, you're going to click on edit profile. And in this new win window that appears, you're basically going to draw the whole wall as you can see it from the front. So you keep that in mind, you're drawing the facade of the wall basically. Just yeah, so I'm going to cl click on the line tool and I'm going to just start drawing my wall the way I want it. First I'm going to draw the basic outline of it, maybe like this, and I'm going to do right now just whatever shapes I want. Now I'm going to click on the arc circle tool, maybe draw a circle, I'm going to click the line tool again, I'm going to draw one of these weird triangles and maybe just a regular rectangle. Once you do that you're going to select your fill tool. Then select whatever geometry method you want. I'm going to select this one on the left. Once you do that you can either trace the outside just trace this shape of the wall like that. I'm gonna click undo to show you another option, or you can hold down the space bar and then click on the on the outline of the wall. So once you did that, you have to uh, take out the shapes that you want to be holes. The fill is gonna be the actual wall, and whatever is not fill, it's gonna be empty. So there's gonna be no wall there. So what you're gonna do one while you still have your fill tool selected, you're going to select the fill that you just draw, hold down the spacebar, as you can see this little wand tool, wand tool appears, it's the magic wand, and you're going to click on the shapes that you just drew, and that is, gonna, that is how you do the openings easier. You can also just trace them out, but it's easier with the magic wand tool. So, so once you did, once you have, you created the fill that you want, you're gonna click on store profile, and you're gonna rename it. I'm, I'm gonna rename it one. Click on OK. Click on escape. You can get out of here too. Okay. Okay, so now that we're done with drawing out the shape of the wall that we want, we're gonna go select our, our wall tool again. Make sure once again that here you have selected the complex profile option, so the farthest one on the right. And then on these options on the right, you're just gonna pick the custom profile that you just created, which is the number one. In my case, I named it now with the number one. Once you do that, as you can see, I clicked once for the beginning of my wall and I'm not gonna give it a big thickness because I want the wall to well I'm gonna show you in 3D so I'm gonna put the uh, distance 0.2 which is 20 centimeters I'm gonna go in with the marquee tool I'm gonna outline what I wanna see in 3D and I'm gonna click F5 once I'm there you can see the wall is created. It has the profile that we drew and the thickness that we gave it in the plan view. This is a really good way to create walls that are maybe have a lot of perforations and you don't want to create those by using the window tool. So this is how I achieved this. Of course it took way longer to draw all of these in the profile manager tab but once you have a pattern down it goes pretty fast okay hope this helps bye